Hey people, this is Steve, and welcome to the box break that you've all been waiting for of the 2011 Panini Gold Standard football. Sealed box, as you can tell by how shiny it is. I haven't broken the plastic off yet. In this box, there's 12 cards, as some of you may or may not know, and those will go out to the teams that they're listed on on the cards. So a um, couple of things just to go over just to make sure we're cool with the rules if you didn't read closely enough or if I didn't explain it well enough. Um, with 12 cards, obviously, there's uh, a lot of winners. There were actually eight teams not bid on, but the other 24 were shared by multiple winners here. And uh, if you do not win, if you don't get a card from the 12, I will hook you up with something from my inventory of over 18,000 cards, um, all football, you will get a player from that team that has a book value equal to or greater than what you spent on the bid. Uh, not counting shipping, of course. So if you bid $5 on your team and you come up empty handed, I'll hook you up with a $5 card of someone from your team. My choosing, of course, but I'll try to make it, you know, someone reasonable. Anyway, so that's what happens there. So everyone will get something from this uh, break. And uh, if you haven't seen these boxes before, there's some pretty nifty stuff in here. And uh, I was telling Ed, the winner of our Green Bay Packer team, that had I done a break on the last box I opened, which I really just did for myself, there were three Packer cards in there, including a rare Charles Woodson autographed jersey numbered out of 10. Ended up getting 220 bucks for that. Anyways, the point is, <clears throat> good stuff here. It might be 12 different teams, or some one of you might get a multiple shot. As you can see, I am representing... Carolina Panthers for the day. Not that I'm a huge fan, but um, Carolina was the top highest bid team, and I spoke briefly with Tracy and said, hey, I'm going to give you, I'm secretly hoping that you get that Cam Newton that you obviously want, so we'll see. We'll see what happens, but I hope all of you are satisfied, and uh, of course, the eight teams that didn't get bid on, those will go to me. So without further ado, I have a, a list, and I'm not going to well, it's going to be hard to see this because of its yellow paper, and I didn't really think. But as you can see, it says, you know, the bid was ended on uh, June 5th. I have a list of everybody. I'm just going to read through it really quick, just so you know that this was done after the auction. Um, Philly goes to Bill. Uh, Denver to Kerry. Pittsburgh to Chris. Buffalo to Craig. San Francisco to Joseph. Tennessee, Atlanta, Jacksonville, Chicago, and Oakland all go to Kevin. New England, St. Louis, and Kansas City go to Rick. Minnesota goes to Ryan. Baltimore goes to Tim D. Tampa Bay and Arizona goes to Tim O. New Orleans goes to Todd. Carolina and Cincinnati goes to Tracy. Dallas goes to Meredith. Green Bay goes to Ed. Detroit goes to James. And the New York Giants goes to Michael. Houston, Indy, Cleveland, San Diego, Seattle, the Jets, Miami, and Washington were unbid, so those all go to me. But don't be fooled, I will most likely be selling whatever I get um, on eBay, so if something catches your eye, just stay tuned. It'll probably end up on there anyways. So I think that's about it. I do want to point out that if a horse, historic teams come up, like I mentioned in the description for example if you get a Warren Moon Houston Oilers card that goes of course to the Tennessee Titans winner not to the Houston Texans it follows the franchise not necessarily the city um, the Browns of course are recognized as being intact and completely separate from the Ravens so um, Brown stuff stays with Cleveland and Ravens stays with Ravens so I think that should be explanatory. Um, you know, the Rams have moved around, the Cardinals have moved around, the Colts have even switched from Baltimore to Indy, but you all know what's going on with that. So um, that's about it for the teams. I think it's time to crack this bad boy open. I will take the bottom card off and put it on top because the bottom card from what I've typically seen is a base card. And um, yeah, and then I'll flip through them, and hopefully the big hit will be the last card, and everyone will be satisfied. So here we are. The big sleeve comes off. There's the checklist. Um, typically, I see uh, redemption cards 
in these packs, so we'll have to look up one of them, most likely. Let me do this so that you can't see what's going on. Got to make the drama, right? It's part of why we do this. So, I'm not going to put that bottom card on top, because I think that might be kind of special. There's a little heads up. It might not be the big hit, but it didn't look like a base card. So, first up, what do you know? Carolina Panthers. Jonathan Stewart, running back. Ooh, these are hard to film. They're awfully shiny, obviously, gold standards. If you haven't seen these, this is number 23 out of 299. So, of course, that goes to Tracy, Carolina winner. So you at least got something there, Tracy. Maybe not Cam Newton yet. Next up is uh, a rookie card from the Cleveland Browns. If I can hold on to it. Phil Taylor, defensive tackle. First round, 21st overall pick. And this one's numbered 41 out of 299. Well, Cleveland is not owned, so that goes to moi. So that's my first one, but plan to see that on eBay. Um, a Legends card. And the Legends are in black and white here. Terrell Davis of the Denver Broncos, pictured here in the Broncos, of course. So, Carrie, you win Terrell Davis. Historical pick numbered out of 299, 260, or excuse me, 285 out of 299. So Carrie gets something for her return. Um, another rookie card of Lee Smith of the Buffalo Bills. Lee Smith is a fifth round draft pick, tight end. And yeah, this one's numbered out of uh, 299 as well. It's number 16. 299. I apologize for this not coming in very well, but these cards all look great. I'm sure you'll all be satisfied. So Buffalo, that is Craig. You get a card of Lee Smith, rookie card. All right, we get into some inserts now. Here from the Dallas Cowboys, which is uh, Meredith. You get a Troy Aikman card, the Golden Anniversary Troy Aikman card, numbered out of 299. 67 out of 299. Let's see if we can see this. There we go. Once again, everything's so golden, and it would be tough to film. But pretty cool stuff. So Dallas comes through with a hit. We have a Golden Leaf rookies of not autograph, just the regular one of uh, the Lions, Titus Young, wide receiver Titus Young. And it's numbered 172 out of 299. That goes to James, Detroit Lions. Uh, here's one that's flipped upside down. A jersey swatch, golden anniversary, a white jersey piece of Wes Welker of New England. Got a white jersey swatch there. This is numbered. Uh, 61 out of 99. So that, of course, goes to Rick. You got yourself a Wes Welker. Frank Gore of the San Francisco 49ers goes to Joseph. A red jersey swash, swatch, excuse me, gold rush. Frank Gore. Numbered 88 out of 99. Oh, ho, ho, what do you know about this? Christian Ponder of Minnesota. I think you're going to be pretty satisfied there. Who is this? Who is this? Oh, sorry. Ryan. Ryan, this is a patch autograph. This is clearly the K from Vikings right there. Let's try to get that on film. Pretty nice, and an autograph down here, numbered out of 325, 314 out of 325. Obviously, the 12th overall pick in the draft. 
Christian Ponder, a lot of a lot of upside there. Way to go. Way to go, Ryan. Not to be outdone, however, a rookie autograph. Gold leaf rookies with a purple jersey patch. Note, not more Vikings. Baltimore Ravens. Tory Smith. Are you kidding me? Look at that. Good stuff there. Numbered only out of 50. 10 out of 50. Baltimore. That goes to Tim D. You just scored. Now we have an autograph. Rookie. Of Quentin Carter. The Denver Broncos. Numbered out of 499. Autograph at the bottom 70 out of 499. So another hit for Carey of the Broncos. Quentin Carter. He's a safety, by the way, the fourth round pick of the Broncos. My Denver Broncos. And the final card in here is a Golden Age insert of Forrest Gregg of the Green Bay Packers. And this one's numbered out of 299. Played from 56 to 71. I'm not too familiar, but Packer fans. So, Ed, you do get a Packer. It's not the one you're looking for, but hey, Forrest Gregg, defensive, or offensive tackle, excuse me. So let me go through these because I know I wasn't, I was spending time reading them and not making sure they showed up well. So real quickly here, we have... Jonathan Stewart, Carolina. Terrell Davis, Denver. Lee Smith, Buffalo. Troy Aikman, Dallas. Titus Young, Detroit. Wes Welker, New England. The double hit. Forgot to mention that. Sorry. San Francisco, 49ers. Frank Gore. Christian Ponder with an awesome card from Christian Ponder, I think. With the K there. That's Minnesota. Troy Smith, the autograph patch, that's Baltimore. Quentin Carter, that's another hit for Denver. And Forrest Gregg, that's Green Bay. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. So, nine of you got a winning hit. Oh, oh, and I forgot Phil Taylor of Cleveland, but that was the one that does not have a team. So I will be sending out these cards uh, tomorrow because you've all paid up and uh, well if you haven't paid up then you're not getting this video until you do. So um, thank you all again and uh, those who did not win I will have your cards if not tomorrow definitely the next day. So um, I look forward to doing this again and uh, check me out. I always got stuff coming up. So. Peace.